Leicester City's players may have been sorry to see Craig Shakespeare sacked but there was no trace of self-pity here as they came from behind to earn the place in the Carabao Cup quarterfinals. Leeds United took the lead with a lovely goal by Pablo Hernandez but that was the catalyst for a commanding fightback by the hosts, who retorted with fine strikes from Kalechi Hianacho, Islam Slamani and Riyad Mahrez. This was Leicester's first home game since the dismissal of Shakespeare, to whom the caretaker manager Michael Appleton had been assistant. The club's vice chairman, Ayawat Srivatanaprabha, used his program notes to hail the ousted man as universally popular before adding but we need to keep the club moving forward, consistent with the long-term expectations of our supporters and the board. And our focus now is on appointing the right candidate. It's an appointment we'd clearly like to make as soon as possible, but we want compromise our goals in haste. There was no official confirmation that the candidates interviewed so far include Claude Poole, the Frenchman let go by Southampton in June. Jesse Lingard double sends Manchester United strolling past Swansea City read more. The visitors know all too well about being in turmoil but Leeds arrived at the King Power Stadium as a relatively stable club, riding high in the championship and exuding optimism under new leadership. But as they face a duel on Friday against the Sheffield United, the team won place above them in the championship. Thomas Christensen deployed a weakened side here. Calvin Phillips the only survivor from the lineup that started Saturday's win at Bristol City. Leeds fans, meanwhile, travelled in force as always and helped generate an atmosphere that made this feel like more than a contest between a pair of second strings. The early exchanges on the pitch were tame. However, that changed in the 12th minute when J. Roy Grot swapped an iffy 1-2 with Kemar Roof before firing off a shot from 18 yards to force a save from Ben Hamer. Roof tested Hamer again moments later and then, in the 25th minute, he embarked on another run in field from the right before offloading to Hernandez five yards outside the Leicester box. The Spaniard wriggled away from Mark Albrighton before curling a delicious shot from 20 yards into the net via the underside of the crossbar. It was a deserved lead for the visitors, who had controlled most of the match until that point, but they relinquished it within four minutes when their goalkeeper, Felix Weedwald, rushed off his line to clear a pass over the top before Islam Slamani could collect it. Weedwald would have been better off pouncing on the ball, as his weak clearance went straight to Kalechi Hianacho, who placed a fine shot into the bottom corner of the unguarded net from 20 yards. It was the Nigerian's first goal for the club since his 25 metres transfer from Manchester City. Carabao Cup Roundup Bristol City thrash Palace to reach quarterfinals Read more. Demarai Gray threatened to put the hosts in front but drove wide after a searing run. He went even closer just before halftime, thrashing a ferocious shot against the bar from more than 25 yards. Leeds endured several self-inflicted scares early in the second period. First, Gray missed the target after Slamani teed him up following a slip by Pontus Jansen. Then Weedwald got lucky when he was marooned by a bad back pass that Slamani intercepted. The Algerian pulled the ball back to Andy King, who ballooned a shot over the bar. If that was fortunate, the escape on the hour was barely believable. Slamani sparing the visitors by heading over an empty net from three yards after a fine cross by Albrighton. The reprieve was temporary. Slamani redeemed himself by side-footing into the net from close range after an incisive move involving Hianacho and VCTO Arabora. Mara's rounded off the scoring in style, topping off a 30-yard dash by curling into the bottom corner from the edge of the area.